Hello everyone, welcome back with our SPS video today. We're back on Fantasy RSPS, our super hype, bright new custom server right here that just got released a week ago. And today, we're going to be checking out a bright new update. I'm very, very excited. The server is doing absolutely amazing. There's over 300 players online every single day, replay account. And this is going to be absolute freaking insane. The giveaway is going to be $50 worth of store credit to one lucky winner. All you have to do for that was like the video, comment your names down below. And of course, make sure to join joining Fantasy with links down below. And I would say, let's get right into this video. Fantasy game updates. Number two right here, Lucky SP, Altex boxes and accessories, Nightmare Zone, and Major Quality of Lives. First things first, a brand new season pass has been released right here for much. Absolute amazing. Make sure to go ahead and grab one of those bad boys right here. Season pass are always very okay. Next on the list, we have the Lucky SP Zone right here, which is similar to the Impulse Zone. Plant the Rainbow Flower in order to teleport to the Lucky Zone right here. With a teaser for a new gambling update coming soon. That is absolute crazy. We've not really seen a custom server coming up with gambling content as well. So that is going to be very, very exciting. And we're definitely going to be checking this out in a second right here. But before, let's check out the cosmetic key you guys will be able to grind in there. The lucky set gives 8% damage boost per pace in cosmetic slot compared to the 5% that Impulsive gives. It also dissolvable for $100 bond compared to the $50 bond from the Impulsive one right here. The Lucky Cosmetic Gate is obtained from the new Season Pass Zone. Nightmare Zone minigame. The new Nightmare Zone is a major content piece on this update, and holy shit, I'm so excited. Want to create a new idea of how to introduce better items into the game without having to release new boxes? Make old gear not worth anything. The Nightmare Zone is similar to the one you find in RS. The cost to enter is Nightmare Shards, which you can obtain from dissolving Trinity Paces. So that makes sense because you have to dissolve previous pass slot items or at least OP items into those shards right here in order to be able to go in and unlock the brand new pieces, which is absolutely nice. One Trinity Piece will dissolve for 5,000 Nightmare Shards. Note that Nightmare Shards will be dissolved for coins in the future. For the Nightmare Zone, you'll have three different difficulties. Easy, medium, as well as hard. You can rate the specifications right here. One point per kill right here that you guys will be farming, and it will cost you one night shot per 10 seconds spent in the zone right here. For the medium zone, you guys will be getting two points per kill right here. However, it will cost you three night shots per 10 seconds right here. And the heart one right here, you will be gaining five points per kill. However, it's going to cost you four night shots per 10 seconds. This sounds the most of people, to be honest, and you will gain in combat XP, unlike the easy and medium one right here. And soul split will not be allowed and usable in the heart one. Holy shit, let me know down below which zone is going to be the most efficient one. Once you enter the Nightmare Zone, there will be seven different types of monsters that can spawn, all with different amounts of health and model designs. Absolute nice, you guys can see the gif in the background right here. Hey, absolute freaking fantastic. You'll collect points which you can spend the Nightmare Shop for the Trinity MU right here. Oh boy, that is some really nice endgame content extension right here. And you can track your Nightmare Points in the Quest tab as well. Now we have the Trinity Imbue gear right here. The new Trinity Imbue gear is obtained from using Trinity Imbue on the Trinity gear right here. Warning, doing this will make the Trinity Eye gear untradeable. And dissolving Trinity Eye will only give you back the regular Trinity gear. That is crazy, bro. This will be added in the future right here. So you can combine those two right here to get the new Bastard Slot gear right here. The Trinity Eye gear. And then you guys will not be able to trade those items that... And right here, we can see the scythe in-game. It looks absolute freaking nice. And I'm hella sure it is absolute freaking broken in-game as well. Oh, look at that. I'm actually wearing it in-game. This is the entire set right here. As you guys can see, it looks absolute freaking beautiful. Together with the Trinity scythe right here. And we're also having those brand new Altex Aura as well as Altex Ring. We're going to talk about that next up. And right here, you guys can also compare these stats. Trinity Body, for example, gives 1,250 percent i think the drop rate bonus right here and plus 56 million in damage and the imbute version right here 1625 that's a huge jump right here and also the damage a massive jump as well Alrighty, into the accessories right here the alt accessory are the new bust and slot tribrid and obtained from the altex defender boss or the tier 14 creation we also upgrade the trinity box and caskets to have these new accessories in so the trendy boxes are the way to go, geez. Here we have the Altex Defender boss. As you can see, absolute nice model right here. You can unlock this boss for 7 billion in cash. It's also important to mention you can also get it as a Slayer Tiles from the Trinity Slayer Master. Drop tables right here. You can see all the different Altex pieces that you guys will be able to get. 
On top of that, there's a brand new pack that you guys will be able to get right here. The really cool part on the packs on Fantasy is you actually don't need RNG to unlock them. You need a specific kill count of that specific. So, for example, for the Altex Defender pack right here, the requirements are 40,000 Altex Defender kills right here. The benefits are 1,050 drop rate, 700% double drop rate, and 22% damage boost. And right here, we can see them once again. They look absolutely freaking beautiful. My highlight definitely is the aura, right? The Altex aura just looks so freaking insane. Absolute nice work there. And right here in the tier 14 upgrade tier, you guys will be finding the Trinity pieces as well as the Altex PC guys will be able to go ahead and create and forge. Absolute freaking crazy. You will see all the different items you will need to farm before of that. Looking super, super nice. You can enter this interface for the creation skill right here. Definitely one of the most important content pieces on fantasy in order to be progressing your accounts. Rare goodie bags next on the list. These are the brand new goodie bags obtained from voting, event shop, as well as from the column, column deals right here. As you can see, you guys will be able to get all those lovely prayer stuff right here, which looks absolutely nice. Then we have the auto claim potions right here. After the potion expire, they automatically renew if you have the potion inventory. Absolutely nice. Then we have the brand new Slayer ring right here. Uh, that will give you double XP while doing Slayer. And you can also buy this ring in the Slayer shop for 20,000 Slayer points. Next to that, local giveaway system. That is crazy nice. This is a new interface that will be used on live streams and during events. It will show you exactly who's entered right here. And you guys will be selecting a winner through this interface. Very, very nicely done. Make sure to be entering and joining all those fantasy content pieces right there. Because you guys can only win something. And we have the prior benefit both right here all of the damage prayers have been both which is absolutely nice as we can see there are some custom prayers you guys will be unlocking on fantasy and all of them has been buffed then we have the lion companions and eggs oh boy these lions are best in slot so essentially you guys will be able to get yourself companions on fantasy right here and you guys will be able to hatch them through those eggs right here and those lions are the new best in slot ones and holy shit Hatching an egg just looks so freaking nice. I've never seen this on any other Rootsky Private server before. This animation right here and interface has been done so nicely. I'm a huge fan of it. Then we also have added the column column commands interface right here where you guys will be able to check out all the different commands in a sort of book which looks super super nice. Heart cleaning NPC right here where you guys will be able to pay him 10k coins per heart right here to clean the herbs which is also nice. Then we have the quick restarting prayer chamber right here which is also very nice so you can do this quicker right there. You can also see the timer on it. Donation shop box update right here as you guys can see new stuff been added to the donation shop absolutely nice. And then we have also the open or bonds right here option, which is absolute nice as well, as you guys can see right here, rather than doing one by one. Rates quick start right here, which is going to make times even quicker right here for the people who want to grind it. So much quality of life, I freaking love it. Then we have new Slayer Prestige benefits right here, which is definitely one of the most OP content pieces to grind on Fantasy right here. So definitely make sure to be checking out Slayer Prestige and stuff right here. Benefits are absolute crazy. Brand new campaigns that you guys will be able to go ahead and get, which are super IP as well, and will make the most out of your money right here when donating to the server. And finally, a bunch of quality of life updates you guys can check out right here. And we can definitely say another banger of an update has been released on Fantasy. The development team behind the scenes is just absolute freaking crazy right here. We do love to see crazy updates like this right here. So a big, big shout out to the boys. Make sure to show love to the entire Fantasy community right here. Join the server with the links down below. And of course, don't forget to enter the giveaway. Smash the like button and comment your in-game names down below. I'll see you guys online. Thank you so much for tuning in. I love you all. Have a good one and peace out.